Steve. And I'm not Steve, I'm Scott. And so uh, we're here today to uh, enjoy and crack open a Kirkland's single barrel. Uh, and again, we've talked about the Kirkland's brand. It's a uh, bottle by Barton uh, 1792 Master Distillers. And uh, we enjoy it and think it's worth it because the cost, one thing, driving cost, plus it's pretty good, uh, pretty good taste for, for, you know, our, our money anyway. Yeah, um, large bottle too. Yeah. Price, and so it's, it's a big bottle for a reasonable cost. And, uh, these, these are also their yearly releases. They only come out once a year. Um, actually, our very first bourbon hunt on the channel <laughs> was driving 88 miles to the other side of the yes. valley to that go to a Costco. Costco that still had one pallet of these when we got there. Um, so we were lucky enough to find some more this year at our local Costco. But I think you said when you picked it up, there was what, five barrel bottles left? Yeah, there was just a handful of bottles left. And uh, we'll go nuts for this. Yeah, so again, uh, good cost, good taste, uh, good bottle. So it's a one yeah. liter, comes in at 120 proof. Yeah. Um, like I said, what, isn't it like 28 bucks? Yeah, it's like 28 bucks. So, I mean, for one liter of, of decent juice, 28 bucks can't be. Yeah. yeah. And it's we've tried the other two, down. we have not tried the, the single barrel yet. And so. We were able to find it here locally, and we're going to do a fresh crack on the single barrel. So these these just dropped in Costco, I want to say within the last 30 days. Yeah. So they, they go pretty quick. The bottle and bond in the small batch hung around probably six, eight weeks. Uh, yeah. But the single barrel, that one just... It goes. It's gone. Yeah. So, I mean, just on the, the, the amount of volume that's moved out, it can't be bad. Yeah. So anyway, we're going to... Listen for this sound, as we always do, and uh, we'll see what it tastes like. First the tape break. Yep, the tape, tape is broken, and listen. Oh, that was a good one. Oh, good one. yeah. That was good. Mm, I can smell it from here. It smells so good. Oh, that's just straight caramel. <laughs> Unbelievable. Ooh. Yeah, that was a really sweet. Yeah, last year we were able to get our hands on all three of them, but we couldn't get the single barrel. And sometimes when things are a little harder to find, I like to save it until I can find a backup so I can start drinking and enjoying it. And since this year's release of the three came out, we've gotten uh, extras of each bottle. And so now I've, we've cracked up, I think, all of our yeah. original ones from last year because now they're yeah. available again. So, so yeah, we, we got these, we got backups now, and... Uh, now we can enjoy it. And now we can enjoy it, <laughs> and that's what we're going to try and do here. It smells really, really good. Like you said, a lot of caramel there. Yeah. As always. A lot yeah. of oak. Yeah, I, I, there's definitely some oak in there. And some proof. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sins is the nostrils. <laughs> All right. Nice. Same way, so as always. It's a little bit hot. Yeah, it's hot. It'll burn. Well, it's 120. So. But it's definitely got a, a, a nice taste. But there is a, a little bit of burn there. There's a lot of caramel. It's like thick caramel. Yeah. Especially on the back of the palate. Yeah, and it stays. It stays with you there. Good. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. I like that when you can smell it or taste it through your nose. Yeah. <laughs> Because <laughs> it's just got that mmm. Yeah, that's actually really good. I mean, I'm not, I don't know, I'm not, I shouldn't be acting surprised. I love the bottom and bottom, and I love the small bottle. <coughs> so definitely for the price and the size of the bottle, that's the only downside I've noticed. It's the size of the bottle, I yeah. don't have a spot to put it. <laughs> yeah. Definitely for the price. It's, it's always like on my, on my bar I have a, a top shelf, it's like a tier, so there's one and then a lower one. My top tiers are all my Buffalo Trace lineups, my, my Stags, my Elmer TVs, all that. But in the lower tier, 
I have all my taller bottles. Like I have my Johnny Walker Blues up there, and then I have my, all my set of the, the Kirkland's because it's just such a darn big bottle. <laughs> but definitely uh, worth the price. Worth the price on all of these, and and you know that's where I mean we we've, we've talked about it before. We don't go for the secondary market. We don't pay that that kind of money. Yeah. Um, so we we're looking for reasonably priced, good tasting bourbons. This is like a, definitely a really good one um, if you're getting into bourbons and starting out your bar, trying to get get a couple of bottles of these. Um, and just have them. It's not going to cost you much. Uh, if you don't want to put out the Kirkland name, uh, I would recommend just putting it into a decanter, uh, something else. But it's definitely good juice. But if, if if you were like, this would actually be a perfect starter set because you have yes. your ninety-two, your hundred, and your hundred and twenty. So you have that that gradual in. Yeah. If you want the burn or look at that color difference. Between yeah. the 92 and the 120, it's almost twice as dark. Yeah, turn it so they can see through them. Yeah, it, you can see we like the bottle and bond. <laughs> yeah, the bottle and bond in the small batch. Um, I've already killed one of my small batch. Yeah. Yeah. This is uh, single girl. The next in line that I. I think, uh, isn't that our third small batch? Yeah, small batch. Yeah, yeah we, the small batch was really good. And I think I think that was the cheapest of. I think that was like nineteen or eighteen bucks. It wasn't bad. So yeah. I mean, if you could actually you can go buy this whole set for seventy dollars and get all three in our it's one meters because each one's progressively more. I think the ninety two was like eighteen or nineteen. Then the bottle and bond was like twenty three or twenty four ish, and then the yeah. single barrel was twenty. All of them you're not paying much for, and definitely a good um, starting one, or at least have one at your bar. Yeah. This is something that you, I wouldn't, you wouldn't care about breaking out and having to, if you just have like a gathering of a bunch of people, you can break out all three of these and not have to worry about. Oh, what was in our first review? A fireside chat. You know. Yeah. 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 Oh, this, the the finish on this is really good. It just coats your, your mouth in that, that kind of caramel and kind of, there's like one more other note. It's almost like a, an earthy note or nutty note, but it's really good. Yeah, I mean, the only downside is that they they don't come out. You can't just go in and buy all three. Yeah, yeah. there's no limit on them either, so you can pick up a couple bottles. I mean, we've, we've seen people at Costco pick up nearly a pallet. Yeah. And they'll just walk in and just start pulling bottles out and loading up a cart. And like, oh, yeah. Yeah, for definitely for the price, and if you're having any kind of like parties, get-togethers, or stuff, this would be, I would give this, you know, for the price, and instead of going for, like, like if you're having a wedding, this would be something, too, if you wanted to buy it, uh, yeah. to give it, this is something that you're not worried about, uh, you know, everybody's drinking up my good bottle of Sinatra, or something that's costing you like a hundred bucks a bottle. Yeah. So, but it's a, gr a good proof, a good flavor, and it's a good, it's a, it's a good value. Yeah. I uh, I would I would strongly recommend it. Go ahead. As Let always, us know. Yeah. yeah if like you've tried it. Uh, if you think these are a good deal, if you bought them. Um, what do you think? Yeah. If you bought them. Yeah. And would you buy it again? We would definitely buy these again. We're always looking we for do. them every year. We're trying to make sure that we have a flow, a flow going. Uh, again, just because we enjoy it and it's cost effective for us. Yeah. Uh, for that, you know, that so. daily kind of drinker, if you want. So. Oh yeah. Yeah. This this is what the small batch in the bottle and bond actually is really like when you're camping. Yeah. Yeah. That, that's a good a good sipping bottle. We just like said, like we did our first review sitting out by the fire, yeah. and that one just gives you that Kentucky hug. It's warm. It's not harsh at all. It's smooth, and it's just great for sipping. Yep, yep. So, so as always, like, always. subscribe, review, and, and stay, stay win. Stay win.